All right, good afternoon. Thanks for joining us for the weekly wrap up. I'm Emily Martin, the director at MSA West, and this is Taj Gilbert, a senior at MSA West. And he's one of our senior interns. He's going to be helping with the announcements moving forward. So, welcome to the hot seat, Taj. Let's get started. Okay, still on sale are our MSA West um, beanies. So, students can support our, our arts team by uh, purchasing these MSA West beading beanies they will be the only beanies allowed to be worn in the building that's big if you can wear a hat in the building 13 bucks also on sale are our earn your sweats sweat suit so a lot of students qualified and we had some families asking if they could purchase an additional set we asked you to hold off until we got our order in completely and it's here so if you were waiting to purchase a second set um so you don't have to wash as often they're here and available for purchase Let's talk about what worked well this week. Our students did a great job of helping substitutes and visiting teachers learn and manage schedules and protocols during a very hectic here, week here at school. Our teachers hustled like rock stars to cover classes for quarantined or teleworking colleagues, but please grant them a little grace as they may be behind with some gradebook management due to some lost planning time. I know they're gonna bust it to catch up soon. So these are some things we could work on with our social distance protocols. We're only as safe as we keep each other. So please make sure you wash and sanitize your hands, wear your mask and keep your distance. That's kind of hard to do. You have to do it really purposefully, but do you think we can do it, Taj? I think so. So if you guys are feeling sick, please stay home. Uh, you can communicate with the office and you won't, if you are scared of truancy, they, they, we still excuse absences. So just, just get in touch with us. You can stay home if you feel sick. That's right. Better safe than sorry. Nurse Terrio is available to answer questions. She can advise you if you should head to the doctor to get checked or just take the day to um, rest and see if you're feeling better. We want to work together to keep our campus as safe as we possibly can. Moving on to some new information. As you may have seen on social media or received through the J Campus post or the Remind update, Seventh and eighth graders at MSA West will return to the hybrid learning platform beginning this Monday. And this will continue through February 12th. We'll reflect and determine next steps um, for anything beyond that. We'll think about that next week. A letter has been posted on social media and sent through Remind. It's also been printed and put in the hands by me for all seventh and eighth grade families containing more details. But we'll default to what we were doing just a few weeks ago. Hybrid learners will return to their group one and group two assignments. A through J is group one. K through Z is group two. Group one comes to school on Monday and Tuesday while group two stays home and logs in from there. Group two then reports to school on Thursday and Friday and group one logs in from home. Wednesday will still be reserved for office hours and asynchronous learning activities. Our goal with that is we can really meet the needs of the remote learners since we have several of them right now due to quarantine and we can get on a better rhythm to meet everyone's needs safely, efficiently, and productively. Just like last time though, if you're a seventh or eighth grade family and you were coming more than two days because of a specific need that we discussed, that goes right back into effect. Additionally, if you have not taken advantage of that opportunity, please reach out to a teacher. Let them know that hybrid learning presents a significant struggle for you and will find a way to meet your needs. But to be clear, sixth graders and high school students will continue to report to school each day. Our goal is that in, in having two groups go hybrid, our hallways will be less congested, our lunchrooms will be less congested, and we can better meet the needs of our whole student community. And our seventh and eighth graders, we know you're gonna do a great job with this. Reach out if you need help getting prepared for that work. Okay, so although we will not be able to hold a large assembly this year, our school will work to honor and celebrate, celebrate Black History Month throughout February. So this year's Black, National Black History Month theme brings the focus home. The Black family repre repre representation, identify, identity, and diversity. Each day this week, each homeroom will be given 20 minutes to develop, craft, and decorate their door or assemble a doorway display that captures and celebrates what this year theme means to them. Some basic supplies will be given to each homeroom, but students and teachers are encouraged 
to create and bring additional items and materials to bring the, their ideas to life. We will create a shy slow, a shy, a slideshow of the finished product to share with all of you next week's wrap up. So we'll try to find ways to share what we're doing here at school through this weekly wrap up so that you can be better connected to what we're doing to honor and celebrate the month. One more, Taj. We're, we're in it together. Hello, MSA West senior parents. It is yearbook ad time at MSA West. Uh, senior ads in the yearbook are available and include photographs alongside personal messages to your son or daughter. There's a limited number of pages available in 2021's yearbook, so click the link here to see what options are available. Also, if you have not secured a copy of the student senior yearbook, you may do so by selecting the link above. Thanks in advance, Mr. Harris. So I'll be sure to post that link in both the Remind group and in the comment section on Facebook so that you'll have easier access to this information. This exact letter was also sent to all email addresses for the students in the class of 2021. The link is available and live there as well. Well, we did it. Got through our first weekly wrap up. Thanks, Taj. And we look forward to bringing more to you through this format. Thanks for tuning in. Here's to, what, to whatever comes next. Because we're with. Have a great weekend. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Wear your mask.